Will you be happy if I lose myself trying to please you? No way. Will you be happy if I lose my soul trying to please the whole wide world? Tell me, what would it be? Or what would they say? How would it look like? Or what would they think? Just so you know, no one cares. No one cares. Just be you and the world will adjust. And that's why I say. Hey, baby. What's up, my darling MVPs? And how are you all doing? Welcome back to Sale with Mimi Shosley Mimi where you get the gist. I see they do waiting. I see the heart. Of course you know there is no sleeping on a bicycle on this channel. If you snooze you do what? You lose. Are you yet to subscribe to this channel? Or are you still sitting on a far long thing? Kindly pause right there subscribe and make sure you turn on the notification bell if not tell me how do you want to get the gist brewing from the cooking pot like how do you want to get the gist i see the hearts yo massive shout out to this amazing beautiful hard-working and talented lovely biggies babies yo i can't stop appreciating you guys for coming out for Perez to show him massive support and love for his major movie you guys are the real mvps g for life respect Perez did a thing yesterday he made me proud and i am glad god came true for him congratulations Perez ab at real Perez ab now let's do a video thread of some of the guests who showed up to support our guy last night shall we the silence intruder yes the compilation video you just saw of lee quarro soma j paul saga hemi um and all of them that you just saw right on this video you the patriots are taking their time you know taking their time out to thank all the biggest kids that made it happen on perez black carpet premiere on the silent intruder so they just made few compilations in thanking the housemates that attended the silent intruder black carpet premiere they've been trending them all over i think it's a sweet thing to also see god bless all of them all guys let's play this before we continue i saw this on the tl from erika kachi she said who are you gonna kiss date marry slap or trash we have cc we have tacha we have fina we have mercy and we have um venita okay so which of this two for which of this five housemates would you kiss date marry slap or trash so when you get across the section okay all i want you to do for me is let me know in the comment section which of this housemates you would do any of this way okay just the name you just tell me i would do this person i would do that person i will not do this person something like that okay meanwhile let's see some examples of how people actually attended to this question okay let's see what some viewers have to say about this so me said kcc date mercy marry mercy slap tacha trash tacha Slapfina, Trashfina. Superior said, Kiss Mercy, Date Mercy, Marry Mercy. So everything about Kiss, Date, and Marry is all for Mercy. Okay, let's see another one coming from Adeola. Love all, not a fan of Venita. Wow, woo. Marry Lambo, Trash Trasha. Wow. Slavenita, Date Fifi, Kiss Sisi. Trash Tacha, Slavenita, Kiss Date Fina, Marry Mercy, AK. I will date Fina, Marry Mercy, and Kiss Tacha. The rest can hug Transformer. Okay, let's read this last one. Kiss Fina, Date Lambo Money, Marry Queen of Highlights, Wahoo. I won't trash anybody because they aren't worth it, okay? Kiss Mercy, AK, Date Mercy, AK, Marry Mercy, AK, Slavenita, Trash Tacha. Marry Mercy, Kiss Mercy, Date Mercy. Trash Tasha. <laughs> Slav Anita. Slav CC. So guys, tell me yours in the comment section. Let's continue, okay? Now, here is it. 
ever since David Doe lost the Grammy Award, okay, we've not been hearing word on the social space. And now, for people to go to the extra lens, they're actually using Fina's name. Now, see what happened. David Doe said, congratulations on your win, Tyler. Big one for Africa. Keep soaring. And look at the reply. Thank you, love, but I actually don't know who you are. Of course, you and, know that, you and I know that this lady would not reply this to David Doe, never. So people actually are making it look like Fina, you know, I don't know how to put it. They want to make it look like Fina is indirectly fighting with Davido. Because this reply of, but I actually don't know who you are, was never there. Was not even close to be there. So they just want to taint Fina's name. So not, that was not just all. Fina saw some also on Instagram and she had this to say. You guys are really trying hard, I see. To the extent you started creating fake pages for comment like this. Man, you all are bunch of... I skipped that. Too much trying. As in, guys, you see these comments here. Oh, my words. Oh, my word. You see those comments. Fina, look at what the person used Fina's name. Just a few months ago, you claimed not to know me. Now, Grammy claimed not to know you also. And I hear crying. What goes around comes around. Your life never starts to this poor itself. First off, I don't want to believe that Fin Nations are the one doing this. Because if you're the one doing this, that means you do not like Fina at all. Because if you like her, this girl has a lot of drags on her. Why would you want to bring more for her? Why trying to bring more drugs to her? That's what me I really want to get. Because it's really not funny at all. You know, you should post this on your Instagram and ask blogs to take down the post. That's a fake account. Don't play with the, this advice. Omona, you do and we know. You go explain tire. They will block me without me even saying anything. The people where they comment no even get sense. Them suppose no say this one no be Fina. Now see what somebody said. Omona, you do am. So you're trying to say Fina had to go open a burner account to say all of that. <laughs> Maybe you're still knowing Fina. Wahala no complaint like this. Why they are they making fake pages? They must take permission before sharing any information. Why you they move like Osho oh, beg? Fina, respect yourself. Your whole generation. Wow. We're like, um, more. Um, more. What some of you, I keep saying this, and what some of you all will create for yourself from social media. Not only God go help on her. Anyways, Fina said I should tell you people, on the night of this month, we lit this Friday talk remember she actually told us a new part of her is coming out which is talk so Finn nation said come on jam louder i'll be there no matter what so guys like i would always say that girl is one girl that would say she's busy on her lane she's always doing things yes i know Fina can be controversial she can you know be chaotic and all of that but at the same time who say never ever before should actually raise hand Okay, so meanwhile, I think the more you guys are bringing drag for that girl, the more she'll be showing you guys that she's also doing well for herself. So you guys should just take it easy and take a chill pill on this girl, I beg. All right, guys, let's continue. So Groovy Mono posted a picture, like four pictures of him wrapping it up on sets. Remember I told you guys he actually acted a film. So he posted a picture that they just wrapped up the movie. And this comment said, Groovy Mono, you better come and pay my bride price. Because how can you be so fine like this? I don't do fair guys, but you capture my heart. Mm? So... Groovy was on his own. Oh, no. <laughs> this lady said, oh, Groovy, come and marry me. I don't do fair guys. Now, this is what Groovy replied. Groovy said, I don't do fair guys, but now wait till now they always talk. So when he said, I don't do fair guys, but now, now wait till now they always talk. People now throw it back to Fina. Remember in the house, Fina was lamenting she don't do light skin guys. Until she started falling for Groovy, cooking for Groovy. You know, she fought Yakata for Groovy in the house. You know, Dark said, you now ultimate light skin, the alpha male of fair guys. I'm telling you, that's what Fina calls him, ultimate light skin. I know someone said that two years ago. <laughs> Wahala be like bicycle, guys. Oh. The cruise on the social street is not here. Law pretend as not failing for that line again. I get it, Groovy. So fans already grab it because of course they watch the show and they saw Fina saying that and yet, last, last, uh, it was Groovy and Fina till the end. Okay, um, Diane, who said, Diane of the Pepe Dem season, you know, posted and said, Men, please watch romantic gestures make you feel loved, seen and appreciated. I would love to hear your thoughts. Thanks in advance. And then Venita replied and said, Dear Diane, 
is there something you want to tell us? Meanwhile, talking about Venita, she has been saying a lot about relationship these days. I don't know if also she has something to tell us. She said, I am possessive. I want to wear your clothes, your underwear, your jewelry. I want to drive your cars. It is the closest I get to being inside your skin. So, yeah. And then someone replied and said, doing that is good, but falling that hard, nah. Because when it wants to hurt, them go feel it and then she replied and said what's the point in loving if it's not deeper than the ocean i know venita she loves with all of her and when she get hurt such people even get hurt easily but it is what it is so she said something she said three sets today who did i offend please posh replied and said oh don't worry you got this stay hydrated eat something and just try to take it one thing one thing at a time fitness and being extremely good at what you do we pray three sets becomes nine sets a day you know that's the thing they will be praying for all bread and when the bread comes in 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 large quantity you complain and then somebody actually asked her do you remember that silent prayer you prayed the first day you were in the house while others were chatting in the men lounge well, God is working over time to make sure whatever you prayed for in silence comes to fulfillment. God is about to do wonders in your life. And she said, you all saw that. So guys, I have been trying to play it back to remember um, the prayer she made, you know, the first day when others were in the lounge. So if you're a Venita stan, I'm very sure you should remember it because why she said, you all saw that, you know, people were like, and that was one of the reasons I chose to stand you. Unicorn Business Day. Yeah, we did. So the fans are actually saying they did remember. Even some were trying to look for the video. I really want to see the video because I want to see what the prayer point was. But with what they just said, um, because she said three sets a day and then they now said, do you remember your prayer? It means maybe she was telling God, maybe for the outside world to favor her or something like that. But I cannot really pinpoint that particular day. So do you remember that day? Let me know what she prayed about exactly in the comment section. We did, coupled with your entrance, it was pretty hard not to notice how you moved from the lounge. Went, chose your bed in the corner, placed Mado's picture on the wall, sat down and prayed. Yes, we did. It was shown to us. Keep it up, my dear Venita. Believe it. So, they've been trying to let her know that they saw that moment. Though I could not really picture that moment. So, tell me if you two still remember that moment. Okay. So, Alex posted this um, cute video with the pressure says no pressure. Enjoy the rest of your week. It's just kind of motivation. And then... At the end, the part I muted was where a song that has to do with no pressure. You know, some of her fans reply, no pressure, my dear. One of somebody say one of the darkest hearts to ever come out of Big Brother House. They can't pressure us, Jerry. We are not moved by social media noise. No pressure. She was trying to post to motivate her fans. Now look at what somebody say. One of the darkest hearts. Anyways, it is normal for housemates to receive such comments. Now they are coming for her. As Tick Baby said, that one don't turn motivational speaker as brand no branch had domot. Betty with the ugly wigs. Young come back. Now here is the thing. Focus on your faith and stop dissing others, especially when you know your faith is doing well. Why are you not coming for others? Nkobeo, hmm, I am suspecting Brakuda. And she said, Law, no be that one. This one, a Tilogu dancer. Same thing that happened in their first season. One, they packed deals and endorsements. While at Tilogu, they frustrate, frustrated and depressed that she had to leave IG then for some time, thinking her comeback might do the charm, but nothing's up. Everywhere still dry like desert. Now, I'm not going to just mention, you already know, these are CC fans coming for alex yet again you see cc winning her deals doing back-to-back -back success you know that you should focus on her all you have to do is look for ways to diss others anyways i've seen it is something that is common among fan bases on the social streets and it will never stop anyways guys me i'll be dropping my voice right here and now to see you guys later thank you so so much for always sailing with me bye for now guys